For the first time in Hockey Day Minnesota history, two women's teams will be playing a competitive televised game outdoors. The historic matchup between St. Cloud State University and their rival University of Minnesota Duluth on Hockey Day Minnesota will take place at Lake George. SCSU women's coach Eric Rudd says the women's game has come a long way and this is just another chance for them to showcase their talents. Quality of play, the interest, the, uh, 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 the, the amount of talent there is, the depth in our country right, right now, it, it, it's awesome. And, and for us to be able to showcase that on Hockey Day in Minnesota is, uh, is, is truly just, just, just really great for our program. Rudd says getting to be a part of Hockey Day Minnesota was a easy choice. Before it was announced, we were asked if we would want to be a part of it and if we would want to play outdoors, and, and uh, that was a pretty quick answer. I mean, we said yes right away that we would love to, to play outdoors and, and, and be a part of that day. SCSU senior captain and Hail Mary grad Brittany Anderson was in the stands the last time her school was playing on Hockey Day Minnesota. She says she is excited that it is her team's turn to take center ice. It's great to have it in St. Cloud. It's an amazing community and just playing an outdoor game is just something you don't do all the time. Just having that just gives you that much more excitement and you just want to compete so hard and just enjoy it all. After it's all said and done, for some this is just another hockey game that adds to the team's record. For others, it's a chance to showcase the women's game to a larger audience. It brings it in the community more knowing just like this is women's hockey. They're growing. They're in this like amazing uh, Hockey Day Minnesota game. So it really just puts us out there more, and it's, yeah, it's really good. The St. Cloud State women's team plays on Hockey Day Minnesota 1 p.m. Saturday at Lake George. Justin Labonte, WJON.